Meet the black sheep of Captain Marvel's family. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we will explore the comic book origins of Black Adam. I was not expecting a child, but you are marked by the wizard's energy, chosen to one day inherit the mantle of power. I, I don't understand. What do you want from me? Your life. As with most comic book characters, there are often reimaginings and different versions to a character's past. We've chosen to primarily follow the storyline which unfolded in 1945's Marvel Family No. 1, which was expanded upon in 1977's Shazam No. 28 and 1987's Shazam! The New Beginning. This character's origins began in ancient Egypt, where a wizard named Shazam took notice of a proud and skilled warrior, Teth Adam. Shazam blessed Teth Adam with the strengths of six gods to help him protect his land and renamed him Mighty Adam. It was a name that he lived up to until he became so corrupt with power that he overthrew the pharaoh and took over his city with fear and violence. Shazam, unable to retract the powers he regretted giving, could only banish his newly named Black Adam to the furthest star. That wasn't far enough because Black Adam returned. He flew for 5,000 years to seek his revenge. I did not spend 5,000 years traveling across the infinite void of space to be thwarted by some man-child. Powering Teth Adam was the mistake that prompted Shazam to bestow similar powers unto someone young and pure of heart, like Billy Batson, who became known as Captain Marvel. Shazam also granted similar powers to Billy's sister Mary, his uncle Dudley, and his friend Freddy, creating the Marvel family. All of them with the powers of Solomon's wisdom, Hercules' strength, Atlas's stamina, Zeus's power, Achilles' courage, and Mercury's speed, which spells out the acronym Shazam nicely. You could say that Black Adam was Shazam's failed prototype of Captain Marvel, which always makes for a great villain. Eventually, the entire Marvel family challenged Black Adam in the wizard's lair, and defeated him by tricking him into saying the magic word Shazam, which reverts him back to his powerless Teth Adam self. Since Teth Adam was now a 5,000 year old man, he quickly ages his year's worth and dies. But this was not his last appearance. Shazam! In 1977's Shazam No. 28, mad scientist Dr. Savannah resurrects Black Adam with a reincarnation machine. Around this time, Billy asks the wizard Shazam a good question. How did Black Adam get the powers of Greek gods that didn't exist 5,000 years ago? It's explained that Black Adam's powers come from the ancient gods Shu, her chef, Amon, Shihetsu, Anpu, and Menthu. So the Shazam acronym conveniently still holds true. In the 1987 reimagining of Black Adam's origins through Shazam! The New Beginning, it's implied that the creation of Captain Marvel is specifically to confront the danger of Black Adam. In this Captain Marvel origin story, Dr. Sivana is Billy's estranged uncle, who used the inheritance of Billy's recently deceased parents to fund the bringing of Black Adam back from interstellar exile. In these new appearances, Black Adam is sometimes drawn with pointed ears, but the presence of this feature varies depending on the artist in question. Some of the more recent origin revisions of Black Adam introduced a distant Teth Adam relative named Theo Adam. In these stories, Black Adam was imprisoned in a scarab instead of being banished into space, and Theo Adam is instrumental in his escape. The existence of the Marvel family is also since been restored in these revisions. Black Adam, empowered and invulnerable as he is, proves a worthy match for the DC powerhouses like Superman. In one storyline, the entire Justice Society of America could not even bring Black Adam down without taking a trip back in time to use the source of his powers against him. There have been issues where Black Adam has gone good and helped others fight for justice, but he's rarely trusted by his new allies or readers alike. Aside from comics, Black Adam has appeared in various animated series, including Batman the Brave and the Bold, The Kid's Superpower Hour with Shazam, and the Shazam Superman crossover film, DC Showcase Superman Shazam. The Return of Black Adam. When you crush an ant beneath your foot, do you feel remorse? No. Is this because you are evil or because you recognize yourself as a higher form of life? 
This is what the wizard could not understand. Are you a fan of Captain Marvel's greatest foe? For more interesting comic book origins, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. This is not over then. Only death will stop me.